I would like to take this opportunity to welcome everybody to Kidgum District for the 47th anniversary of St. Jana Milwom Day. As we all know, this is just not a simple day. It's a very big day. For those who believe in the work that the late Jana Milwom did, it's just not it's just not a day that uh, it's a public holiday and it's a normal public holiday. This is a day that means a lot for Christians. Having looked at his life story, what he did, the sacrifice he made, it's not something that anybody would want to miss. So I want to call upon all Ugandans to come to Kitkum. Let's pray together. Let's celebrate this day. And we petition God to continue blessing the land, the Acholi land, continue blessing Kitgum district, continue blessing Uganda. And also, we pray that many Jana Nilwoms emerges out of, you know, the many people who have given their lives to serve the Lord. I also want to take this opportunity to call upon government that this is a public holiday that is already planned for. Let's have the resources provided to support this commemoration on time. I often see the community and the, the committee and as the leaders struggle with the budget for hosting this event. This is an event which is already planned for. We know that under Ministry for Ethics, every year we have this event. We don't want to see a situation where the ministry or the finance team seems not to be prepared. This is a day that is very, very important to the people of Acholi because this is our son that gave his life for the people and his contribution in this country can never be underrated. So I want to call upon the people responsible, the ministry, parliament already appropriated funds for this, bring the funds on time, and let's have this day celebrated with honor, with love, and we use this day to pray for each other and pray for our country. We welcome you to Yukitgum district, and we are ready to host you.